In this video, we'll be going over what to do when you get the default algorithm fault code, which is the flashing battery type light, along with the 30, 60, and 100 lights. Let's start by going to either the app or Play Store. You'll want to search for ProView Link and download it to your device. Now that it's fully downloaded, follow the tutorial guide prompts. These help you get more familiar with the look and feel of the app. Make sure to allow for the app to turn on both location and Bluetooth services. There will be specific prompts for each setting. You should now be on the Scanning for Devices screen. This is where the app will auto-generate any PC's devices within range. If you have multiple devices, make sure you're connecting to the desired device. If your device doesn't appear, then click on the little refresh icon at the top right corner. Click or select the device you want to connect to. Once you have tapped on the correct device, you will see a new prompt telling you that the firmware needs to be updated. Click OK to proceed with this update. A status bar will appear, showing the progress of the update. If the status bar fails to reach 100%, then please try another device. After you have installed the update, a new prompt will appear informing you that the algorithm has not been set on this device. Click OK. This will then take you to the home screen. Now tap on the gear icon in the top right corner under the device name. Tapping on that icon will bring you to the setup screen. Now let's select change algorithm. A new window will appear giving you the option to select the correct type of algorithm that corresponds with the type of battery you are using. Tap on the battery type. Click set. In the new window, you will want to check the little red box and confirm your decision. Once you have confirmed your decision, the app should send you back to the home or previous screen. You should now have the regular charging sequence lights on your device. If in any time in this process the screen goes black, or the lights on your charger go out, then please delete the app and start from the beginning of this video. Do not unplug the unit as this might harm the circuit board. If you aren't sure of something, or need a little bit more guidance, then please give us a call at 615-471. 5300 or submit a help desk ticket at www.dualpro.com support. Our technical support team is always standing by to help out in any way they can. We are available Monday through Friday, 8 to 5 p.m. Central Time. Thanks for watching and please like and subscribe for more.